Hi guys, Steve Girardi here. Welcome to Steve Strings. Today I have another review video for you. And this is not your typical ukulele. This is kind of a special ukulele. This is the Oscar Schmidt eight string tenor ukulele. In this case, it is the OU28T-A. This is kind of a unique and special instrument. Um, I've played four string ukuleles. I've played uh, five string ukuleles. I have not really played an eight string ukulele before. And I borrowed this instrument from a friend to check it out and uh, bring it to you. So let's go ahead and go over it. Uh, as I said, this is an eight string ukulele. So you can see it has four courses of paired strings. The, uh, the G string and the E string are tuned an octave apart. And so that means there is a high uh, G and there is a low G. And the same thing for the E string. Um, but the, la the uh, two high strings, the, the, um, the E and the A, they are both um, tuned um, uh, in unison. That is to say, there are two uh, strings that are tuned to the same note um, and not an octave apart. So they have this unique chorus effect. And it's a unique kind of a sound. And I should say that as I'm playing this, it does take um, more pressure on the strings because you've got twice as many strings you're pressing on. But let's go ahead and go over the instrument. Uh, this instrument, I should say, is mahogany in that it is a solid mahogany neck. It is a laminate mahogany body, both uh, top, back, and sides. You can see the headstock um, also has a uh, mahogany veneer on the headstock with the uh, Aloha logo and the Oscar Schmidt by Washburn uh, logo that are both silk screened onto the headstock. You can see that the tuners here are uh, chromed tuners. In this case, they are just eight separate uh, open geared tuners on a headstock that is a little larger than usual because it has twice as many uh, tuning machines. The nut on this is a plastic nut and I measured it, it is a 38 millimeter wide nut. The fingerboard on this instrument at first glance I thought was rosewood but when it's looked at closely you can see that it is a technical or an engineered wood and when you look at it there are striae in it. That is to say it is a laminate but not laminate horizontally the 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 uh, the laminate is laminated sort of vertically. So you can see those lines going the whole length of the fretboard, but it certainly does look nice. You can see this instrument does have position markers on the face of the fretboard. It also has a, a sort of a ivory ABS binding, and it also has position markers on the player's side. This is a three piece net, uh, neck, that is to say it has um, one piece of wood here, it has another piece uh, at the heel, and it has a, a scarf joint uh, at the neck where it meets the headstock. As I said, this instrument has a laminate mahogany, and I'll try to give you a, a, an image there of the grain. It has a nice little grain pattern to it, and this is a satin finish. You can see here that the rosette on this is actually two separate rosettes which consist of lines of black, uh, white, or ivory, and then black. And you can see the outer rosette is a thicker line of white as opposed to the inner one. The bracing on this, and you may be able to see this, is the uh, typical uh, notched bracing, or sorry, the typical notched kerfing you see in ukuleles along with typical ladder bracing. This instrument is a tenor and it does not have a truss rod in it. The uh, bridge on this, you can see, is what appears to be rosewood. Um, and the one thing I did note on this is that um, here in the, in the corner of it, it is lifting ever so slightly there at the corner. Uh, otherwise, it's not lifting anywhere because with eight strings, it's twice the pressure than, than typically. Again, this instrument does not come with any strap buttons, and I'll put a link to the acoustic electric version, which is currently available on Amazon, 
I only found one store online that described this, and it was not the OU28T-A version. So I'm not sure what the dash A version or how that's different from uh, the acoustic electric version or from the uh, the one that doesn't have the A. But overall, you can see it is a, 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 a typical tenor, except it has twice as many strings, which gives it it's certainly its own sound. So I played it a little bit on the way in. I'll go ahead and let you hear it some more and, uh, and, and see what you think of it. So there you have it, a quick review of the Oscar Schmidt by Washburn OU28T-A acoustic eight string ukulele. It has a unique sound, like I said, you have to press a little harder than usually. I was trying some bar chords. I definitely have to press harder for those. But uh, it has, again, A unique sound so if that's something that you like you should definitely check it out I hope you found today's uh, kind of quick review of this instrument uh, interesting if you did please give a thumbs up if you'd like to see more of my reviews or the builds that I do please subscribe I'd love to come back and see more of my videos thanks for watching